Hello. My body just ready. Hello. <laughs> so. Wait, what did you just say? My body is ready. <laughs> that is awesome. Oh, we're start are we starting the workout video now? Okay. Uh, and one and two and okay no. Apply direction. Uh, there's, there's a nice nice ship walking around. Yeah, that's what ships do walk around. It's called a cruiser. Oh, it's a ship. <laughs> you guys do not look happy. Well, to be fair, I wasn't happy when I played this level either. I gotta go back on day one with this shit. Yeah. The, I'm gonna the be honest. Typical honest. Typical dark I have some mixed feelings, feelings about this level. Oh. Yeah. You know what? I should probably be listening to the audio since I don't know what's going on. Well, so. right now they said, right now they hey, said, Captain hey, Keys Captain has been, been captured. Let's go rescue him. Oh no! The keys! Dude, where'd I park my car? Dude, this is a bit of an improvement over what we said, uh, 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 I think it was like in part two about how, uh, the, how, how the levels look more earth-like, it looks a little less earth-like here. Yeah, there's plant life, but it, I, I don't, I don't get earth from, I don't get a lot of earth from this. You know, think about it, this actually looks like Ooh. a lot like another level that I've seen in another Halo game. Huh. Innovation! Yeah, innovation. That doesn't seem to make much sense. Whatever, I'm not gonna get bothered by it. I mean, what, I, the thing I have with this level is that this first part really sucks. I, I am, like, actually, I did forget to mention that I played the first two levels on normal and then I switched to easy because this level made me want to switch to easy mode. This was so hard to take care of on easy mode. I mean, so hard to do on normal mode. So I, which, like, I switched to easy and I said, screw it, the whole rest of the game is gonna be on easy mode now. Did somebody tell that that uh that alien there that you, that Master Chief would be coming from from the other way, and that's why he was he was he was his back oh. was turned. I think so. <laughs> <laughs> dum -dum -dum. <laughs> uh, Cortana, I need you to uh, upload Map Quest right now. Um, what's a map? There is no map. Serious. Yeah, I saw that and I was actually pretty surprised that he actually fell to his death. And by the way, I think this is where my teabagging stops. So, you should be happy by now, Joel. <laughs> nice shot! <laughs> yeah, those cannons are absolutely horrible, especially on Legendary. I cannot see how people can speedrun these levels. Like, they're not that bad. You take the reckless route and plow through the bullets while dashing. Oh, come on. That, that's what I do when I'm bored. That's what I do with Mega Man X. <laughs> like, in, in games nowadays, like, I really want to be careful what I'm doing and not screw up, but back in the olden days, again, Metroid Prime talking, I just plowed through. I didn't care. And that's why I missed a bunch of upgrades. Oh, here's the weird thing. I didn't record Did this because I kept dying so much as something that was so stupid. But here's the weird thing. Whenever I tried, like, milling the grunt, I hit the turret, and the turret instantly killed me. It never even fired a single shot. If I hit it once, it would kill me for no reason. That sounds like a glitch that would get patched in the head online. It is the weirdest thing I've ever <laughs> seen. Like, you guys should have seen it. I was laughing my butt off when I first saw it, and I just kept trying it, and it kept working. But then when I tried doing it when I was actually recording for this part, it wasn't working. So, oh well. But I found that just so odd. How I, I, It wasn't even hitting me. I just, I mealed it once, I instantly died. Hmm. Now, see, this is where I just drop my crap and go, where the hell are we and what is going on with this floaty alien-like thingy? This is a grab lift. They're trying to get up onto the ship because it's like reloaded or like redocking or something right now. Yeah. Who's trying to get on the ship? We are, like, you know, us, Master Chief and a few Marines to save Captain Keys because he's been captured. Oh. And when was he captured? He was captured right after he crashed onto Halo because remember he went down with the ship and he apparently survived a giant crash. No, the the correct answer would be off camera. Oh. I was gonna say that it happened off screen. 
No, because this is part <laughs> three, I think. <laughs> um, I don't think it feels good. Because if it actually happened, I'm sorry if I'm not paying attention. Why are you talking to the aliens, peoples? That has some great blood textures, I'm gonna, I must say. Maybe the aliens speak uh, Earth. I will say, I think the, the, oh. the really... Oh, yeah, Hunters. This is your second... Well, actually, yeah, this is your first introduction to Hunters. Predators! Hunters? Uh, uh, the, um, uh, uh, these, these guys don't have their brains but have their skulls. This is not retro. Oh, that was hard. <laughs> well, actually, I noticed that they're a whole lot easier. This is not just because of easy, but they're <clears> easy <throat> on, like, even legendary... Difficulty. All you gotta do is shoot your uh, assault rifle at them, and you'll die eventually. In the, uh, in the other games, they're much harder to defeat because you can hit bullets at them, but they're a lot more armored. So you have to, like, really carefully beat them. It's, it's almost an art trying to kill all of them. Do they have an instant kill move where they chop your head off? Yes, they do. Well, it's oh, not really, really chop your head off though, but like, <laughs> they could, they, it, like the 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 motion they swing at you, you they could chop your head off. But instead, you just like fly super high in the air. Oh well, close enough to resonate people then. <laughs> but like, no, their their jabs are extremely powerful. They will kill you in one hit, no matter what difficulty it is. Wait, is it working? No. <laughs> There have been some times where I actually got into the Warthog, uh, not Warthog, the, the Pelican enough that I can just, like, leave the area, but then I get hit by an invisible ball and fall to my death. That thing's called a Pelican? Yes. Because it holds All right, a... Alright, I'm done. I'm done with this. I'm done with this one, sir. <laughs> <laughs> you will stay, because we need a third person with us. What? Just... Just don't tell me what's next. The the meerkat. <laughs> don't worry, Kevin. We'll replace you with a pretzel bag. <laughs> <They're> actually... <laughs> no, no, okay. Halo. And then you instantly get like a thousand views. Now this is actually. Joining us today is Sword, Mega Man 64, and Pretzel Bag. Pretzel bag. Your favorite. <laughs> Wait, what happened to him? I ate him. <laughs> don't worry. He was full of air. Or or here or here's a joke for fans of yo video games. Uh, squeaky chair as a commentator. <laughs> squeaky chair. Well, this is also like the this is the fans I think most beloved level. They just it's just because of the this area in general. Like I don't know. I think they just really love the design of so the alien party ship. Themed. I don't know, I just... It does look like this a... is a place where I would just hook up some mad beats. Yeah, it does look like a place to party. It does, oh my god. <laughs> are, are are we nerds extra. if we know how to party? You guys are gonna... What is this... What is this place at... Um, what actually is this place? This is a crew... This is what they call it. <laughs> look at this like, Think of it as like a battleship in real life, where, you know, they have airplanes and everything. This is kind of like that. They can hold, like, okay, what they call dropships and, you know... You, in in your speak, they call phantoms. So like, they can carry phantoms. They can carry banshees, which are air like which are like their ships, their planes, or their jets. I guess I could best say. And they, they're just they're big battleships, and they're big car uh, carriers. They they're called carriers and cruisers. And well, when they well, get well, in the carriers, they get down. I was gonna say. Well, they well, <laughs> well, I was gonna say. Well, there you go. You got a portable dance club. <laughs> Actually, why they call this level Truth and Reconciliation is because the ship is called the Truth and Reconciliation. Wow. Oh, no, no, no. you have... Great you have, naming. Like, the name of... Really the, good creativity there. No, the name of one of the great, like, the great fleets, actually, where the Arbiter was uh, general on, it was, like, the Fleet of Inconsequential Justice. They have the, they have the most, like, poetic and at the same time, like, most... I don't know, patriotic names I've ever heard in any in any form. Was one of the main communists. I just I still can't get over it. The fleet of inconsequential justice. Where the hell did they get these names? <laughs> <laughs> uh. Alright guys, we uh, hired a senator today to uh, come up with some names for our sci fi shooter. <laughs> I mean, I'm not saying as a as a complaint. These are actually pretty cool names, but it's so hard to say. Hey, we ran into the fleet of inconsequential justice. <laughs> <laughs> it's 
call it the Fleet of Justice. The Fleet of Justice. But then Batman would be on it. And, you know, we can't win with Batman on a, on the air side. Uh, Don't uh, worry, if we give uh, him 30 minutes to prepare, he'll figure out something. Yeah. <laughs> Welcome to part two of the part three of the Halo Combat Evolved Let's yeah. Play. <laughs> you stop dropping the calls! Oh, wait, I think this is where you are. Uh... Or, or or actually to reference uh, SGB likes to play <laughs> uh, and uh, mean, meanwhile in a parallel nice universe. Actually, this makes me to raise the question: How am I going to edit this out? Like, do I just keep playing the video? Yeah. Uh, just just put, just just put some kind of uh, uh, cap. Just put some kind of caption in the middle, in the middle of the of the part, say, <laughs> saying okay, <laughs> saying okay at the, at the, at this point. Uh, some somebody dropped, so we have to, so, so we have to edit out a bit. Actually, I think like, uh, I think I'll just like when I when I hear myself drop from the call, I'll cut the uh, cut that part out, and then I will like cop. I I, I know what to do. I, I'm pretty sure it'll work to my favor. All right. Well, it's a good thing we hired that new guy Harry, to our team to uh, do all the editing for us. <laughs> He's way better than Larry. Yeah. God damn! If we ever mention Perry again, oh. <laughs> the platypus? Of course he never did anything. He was a bloody platypus. Just yeah, kept but... running off with his stupid hat. Yeah, man, platypuses are assholes. Bitch. <laughs> 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 I don't mean to be racist, but. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, that's not racist. Uh, when furries get out in 2016, yeah, it's gonna be racist. <laughs> so we might as well just cover it here. Oh, great. First gay marriage gets approved. Now platypuses are apparently... Ugh, God. It's so much to get into. Too much politics. Anyway, let's get back to that part where you died. What happened there? Um, I'm, I'm pretty sure I don't know. That's why I kept it in the video. Oh, uh, okay. Like, I just found it hilarious. Like, right after you died, some soldier said, Nice one! And I was like, <laughs> like just, just throw in the... Uh, Harry, just throw in the, the Stormtrooper sound, like, sound screen. <laughs> It's, ah! it's, <laughs> sword just got Can't headshotted. That's what happened. It, it was so <laughs> weird because I wasn't. I mean, I had good enough health, and there was a grenade didn't go off. I, it, oh, there was. Actually, I'm not gonna spoil that for you, so you can keep. We'll just. We'll, when that comes, I'll let you know. But, <laughs> but I don't know. It just. I just died out of nowhere, and I don't know why. Be prepared for a lot more funny deaths in the future of these uh, commentaries. And my version of oh yakety sax. That's at least that's what I call them. I don't have any funny dots in Metroid. Even watching this video is just so boring to me. Because... Well, it's not really funny in Metroid. Yeah. Like I, this is I, ragdoll effects. I I I I died twice, but I cleverly edited them out. You won't tell when. Well, it, like with me, is that I only edit. I, I haven't found a time where I have to edit out deaths yet because most, it, pretty much all the deaths so far are absolutely hilarious to me, so I keep them in. Either that or, uh, yeah, I think so. I think there's like one time or a couple times where I'm in a tank and I keep dying and I get pissed off, so I'm like, fuck this, I'm gonna totally beat this shit up! And then I get really pissed. You, 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 um, you know what I problem? You, you know why I hit my edits in Metroid when I go through the doors. Listen, listen. If it, it listen to the music, if it re, if, if it resets, you can tell that I, that I uh, edited edited something. Ooh, out. interesting. Yeah. I, I wonder if like Master Chief is like going through all this. It's like you know, despite all the asshole aliens and all this blood, this would be a really nice dance club. I think... maybe, maybe we should take it over. <laughs> <laughs> maybe I'll just uh, upload Cortana to some uh, holographic uh, stripper ball. <laughs> you know what? In this game, you're supposed to be the inter. You're like uh, Master Chief's supposed to be like the interpretation of the player. That's why he almost has no lines. Well, yeah, that's yeah, that's kind of what I figured. That's the po that's the point of a few protagonists. I still think well, that he, he had two like I think he had the least amount of lines in Halo Three because he said almost nothing the entire time. Plus, don't get me don't get mad at me, but I think his voice is kind of um, what put it uh, average. Yeah, it's all right. I, I can see where you're going with, but like I don't know. He seem he sounds older even though he's like in his forties. 
Yeah. For a second, I thought you were gonna say you sound like Mike Tyson. <laughs> I think now, it's, now, yeah. now, I want, I want all you Covenant people to just stay out there. I can get tired of Chief's voice, but I will never get tired of Sergeant Johnson's voice because it's just, it's so awesome. Get out of my way. I, I think I've killed a couple of Marines in my lifetime. <laughs> I cannot believe I just said that. Uh, but for all you Navy SEALs, uh, you're good. Yep, you're good. <laughs> so, do you remember, um, no, you probably don't remember, um, that, uh, me, Robert, and David, we did this, like, really dumb thing at Camp Crystal, uh, That's where we... band camp. <laughs> <laughs> where we, where we, like, uh, clapped our hands and it was like, we are Navy SEALs, arf, arf, and, like, we just, I don't know, it was dumb. <laughs> yeah. Shut around and stuff. That is a pretty odd story you just told us, Kevin. Please tell us again. Uh, why not? Oh god, this level. Harry, scary. edit that out. Have you guys ever heard of a band game called Mushroom? Something called what? Mushroom. It's a it's a it's a band it's a band crossover with a bunch of uh, video games and. Uh, uh, some some of some of the levels some of the, uh, some of the worlds they have uh, are uh, are based off um, other video games that uh, that don't have anything to do with playable characters, and uh, one of them is actually a Halo world. Oh yeah, the hunters again. Yeah, I said like I said, these things are a lot easier on like in Halo One and every other game. They start to get a lot tougher. See? Just one assault rifle. Done. And now I'm stuck. <sighs> this is why, this is the, my most hated portion of this level. It's just, you gotta wait for them to finally say, okay, here's where you go, idiot. And then you go. And it, oh, oh, that's where I go. You see, that's where a map would have been helpful. Right? There is never... Well, actually, there is one map in Halo 3 ODST, so you'll be happy when there's a map. Other than that, nope. And then they're like, guys, this is this is too much work. I mean, I mean, I, I, I know it's a, I know it's just one room, but it, it's too much. I, I can't. I can't. I think they wanted people to explore, though. I mean, there's no, re there's no true reason to explore, but at the same time, it's just like... Well... Yeah. To be fair, I, th I think the thing with this was that uh, this game was made pretty much by about, what, 20, 10, 20 people? So, really? that, yeah, the, this, these, uh, I mean, the, I mean the, the company got made with just like three guys in their basement or like three guys in a college dorm. Just and like every company. Then when they got bought by Microsoft, they moved to a studio, but there was around like 20 or 30 people there. So, they were just... They were just focusing on making the game themselves. They were low on cash, and I just think they, they were running out of time because the Xbox was coming out. This was, was yeah, like, the, the, I remember hearing in the uh, documentary, like, 50-minute documentary about Bungie, it said that this was going to definitely make or break the Xbox. They had to bring it out, and uh, I think what also helped make the Xbox what it was was because of Halo 2, but we'll get into that when Halo 2 comes out. But... You know, they need to come out with this quickly. It wasn't any time constraints, it was just that they made the game the best they could and they really enjoyed making it. Yeah, yeah, it's fine, but uh it is poss it is possible to encourage uh exploration even with the map just look at Metroid. And uh let's just um and I, I'm confident that uh, the new team, three four three industries, know that what they're doing. I but think let's just hope that uh, uh, I don't have to hear an announcement for the new Halo going. And for the new Halo Five, you will enjoy all our segments with the new Connect 2.0. Well, since I played... you you know they probably will make it compatible with Connect. That's <laughs> not so much though. But uh, if like. Since I actually play Halo 4 now and I've seen what 3 or 4 Industries can do, I think they could use some work, but, you know, 
they could it could have been a lot worse. I'll give it that. I'm not I'm not pissed. Well, I I was pissed at one part, but I'm not pissed at the whole. Look part. at these awesome graphics. Terrible work, three four three. What were you thinking, game designers? <laughs> I know this is sarcasm, but the graphics in Halo Four look freaking amazing. That's sarcasm. Uh, ha ha, funny guy. Wait, are you are you saying I'm sarcasm? Wait, my was sarcasm <laughs> or your sarcasm? That's I am lost. I'm lost. Just like this guy in the game. Yeah, I am lost. I really am lost in this level. God, where? That would be mostly uh, confusing to me. Like, really annoying, actually. I I I'm assuming this path is like slightly linear. Yes, kind of like Metroid. But there's still plenty of like plenty of ways you can get lost, though. I think this is the most like Metroid will ever get in terms of this play. Let's let's play. Maybe, maybe uh, the last level two. I have to disagree. Oh, 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 oh. and uh, and another level two. That's gonna be. It. I almost actually did get lost the first time around. I had to like restart the game just because I was taking so long. Ooh, dead ass. Yeah, that was. I was gonna say nice to. <laughs> I forgot how long it took for the needler to finally kick into its explosions. Oh yeah, there we go. That's the thing I know about. Why do they call it a needler? Couldn't, it fires, couldn't tell you. Fires needles? <laughs> Duh. Nope. Nah, no, can't be that. Does it do extra damage if you smack somebody with it? The Needler actually does get faster in the other Halo games. That's some. That's all I can say to this because there's silence again. It's kind of weird. The melee works. He like he hits it with the butt of another gun, and then he just like he switches his hand back to the trigger. I don't see any sense. Well, of it. like See's yeah, like, it's I'm just weird. Like like, why don't you just hit him this? with the needles instead of like having to take out your arm, use that arm to like hit him with it instead? Why not just like hit him? Uh, like yeah. grab a needle and then just hit him with it. No, just pick the needles off and throw it. Use them as throwing. Knives. Yeah, that makes sense. Cool. I, I hope <laughs> in the future. Cool. I hope in the future I have the the ability to like to like melee them while shooting them at the same time. Wouldn't that be fun? Well, you mean like 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 putting them like beating them into submission to the ground and then you know as you're holding them down you just pump lead into their face. <laughs> oh, no, even even simpler than that. Well, that, like, yeah, definitely. But uh, I'm thinking, I'm just talking like simpler, like you know, as you like fist the um, pistol in front of them, just shoot at the same time, like like you, I don't know, like uh, you hit him in the stomach with the with oh, the butt, that was and, awesome. then, and then just shoot and let the guts go nuts. I'm sorry, but did you guys see that? That was pretty badass. I I, I was not looking for a second. What happened? Uh, there was a guy that was jumping with a sword, and I set, like, I pretty much no scoped headshot hit him. Oh god, this is like the podcast all over again where you describe stuff. <laughs> I'm probably gonna have to get used to describing stuff for you. <laughs> well, when it comes to these, uh, when it comes to these commentaries, we're gonna have to. I resent that statement. What the hell's wrong with you? Oh, hello. You shouldn't have come here, but thanks anyway. That's pretty much what he says. Okay, fine. I'll leave you back in. <laughs> <laughs> oh, come here with reckless, huh? That's kind of hard for me for you to say, even though you were crawling there like a little bam. Don't drop the alien soap. <laughs> what? What? <laughs> oh, this is a prison area, isn't it? Space. Well, it don't <laughs> drop the alien soap. Oh it god! It is a holding cell, so it could be a prison. I love the way he holds his gun. Like whatever, I'm a soldier. Yep, I'm just gonna just gonna sit just... here while my uh, my super AI does all the work. You know that uh, this is against regulations, but I'm a Spartan, so it's all right. Talking, talking, talking about what we should do. He heard something about like, that they called this place Halo. Which, you know, they didn't have any idea, any idea for the like what they call it, so they just call it the Ring. But the Covenant call it Halo. They're not sure why. 
and they want to find out why, and they want to stop the Covenant before they do something evil. Yeah, if you know the story of Halo 1, you'll know this pretty well. This guy's face reminds me of the... Scott, what So... Uh, never mind. I keep forgetting who's black. It's that sergeant dude. Only Sergeant Johnson is black. Shut up and get behind me, sir. Make sure you add that sir in there, Johnson. Only Sergeant... Think are rude. Only Sergeant Johnson is black. That will be known. Just sitting there with your Johnson. You, your kids, and your Johnson. <laughs> great for this. So, you guys have any questions about Halo so far yet? Uh, I have thousands, but I'm never going to be able to answer them. Oh, really? Don't. Don't. I'm waiting. No. Oh, I forgot what I was going to do at the beginning of this episode. I'll just have to do it next time. We only have three minutes, guys. <laughs> what, Darn do you, it! Do you have any questions so far, Joel? Not really. Yeah. It, it's pretty straightforward, this level is. Uh, the next one is something I feel proud of. <laughs> I'll just say that, because you'll, you'll see when we record the next part, but... Oh, thank God for speed runs. <laughs> How often do you play this? Almost never. <laughs> I've played it enough times to know the game decently well, but playing this again, I know it even better now, especially by level names and like by chron by order of levels. Right. I have to say though, um, I did play um, Halo Reach multiplayer a little bit. Um, I couldn't get used to it, quite honest. Um, however, I, I was uh, I was kind of new. Like the only FPS multiplayer I ever played was uh, Call of Duty, and um, I haven't played Bal. I hadn't I didn't play Battlefield back then. So like when I got into this map, it's like super huge. I'm like, God, this takes forever. And um, I don't know, like zooming with a pistol was weird and everything was weird you get used to it you gotta get you, that's what I like about this game you gotta get good at it it's not like Call of Duty Battlefield it, it, it won't take too long to get good at Battlefield or Call of Duty but in Halo you, if you really want to be good at this game you will take a while it took me years to what are you just it. looking at it then? yeah I'm not gonna try that attempt again <laughs> I'm not gonna After, do like, that again. That, I my level. Like, last like time. you just go all that and like, hey sir, hey, just wanted to make sure I shoot you in the head. <laughs> <laughs> you I'm risked all our lives. I know I you did. would do it, Joel, but this time I'm not. <laughs> Maybe in Metal Gear Solid Four, I do. But I wonder what the heck like this this <laughs> alien captain's doing right now. He's like, Captain yeah, Vlog, yeah. our crew is taken prisoner of. Uh, uh, Sergeant. Oh my god, there's people in the room! Not now, guys, doing Captain's Log. Captain's Log. But guys, he's hacking our systems! Captain's Log, don't you care, Captain? Ugh. I certainly don't care about what you're saying, Kevin. Fine. <laughs> <laughs> I don't care. Because I'm just going to say something that'll upset you at the very end of this episode. I'm sure. We will find out in the next part. This part, I will say, is a little bit cool. They're like, we have to go. Oh, wait a minute. Let me just do something awesome. Kill. <laughs> Such an oddly designed ship. That's called the spirit, by the way. Okay. Well, before we end this episode, I'd just like to say one thing. Venus! Venus! Call of Duty is better. Yes, we should all end it like this. Pingus! Call of Duty is better.